Hi guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Dr. Linda Kramer and today I'm doing a monthly horoscope prediction. If you like today's video, please like it. Please share it with your friends if you think that they wish to hear their horoscope as well. Okay, so here we go. First of the month, we are now looking at Aries. This is not a time, Aries people, for spending money, okay? You will want to spend, and believe me, every day you'll have those urges, but you must restrain yourself at this time, okay? So parties, celebrations, and other events will come up where you'll want to spend your money, but please be careful because the message that I got from her for you this month is this. Unexpected changes are coming. So with that in mind, please put away your money for a rainy day. And please remember the message for you this month is unexpected changes are coming. So now we go over to Taurus. Hello, all my Taurusian people. Golden opportunity comes for you this month to be honest with your communication. Okay, so this is a time to clear out all those relationship issues that you've had in the past. Healing unresolved relationships. This is what you're all about this month. So your message for this month is old energy out, new energy in in okay if we want to create better things in our life this is your month to get rid of a lot of that negativity from your past deal with it in honest and open communication with others let them know how you truly feel for your message again is old energy out new energy in gemini's all our June type babies, okay? This is the month for transformations. This is your time to rethink, restock, regather all those life paths and life plans that you've had in the past. This is where you're encouraged to go out and start new hobbies. Start looking at new courses or other things that you want for your future. For this is the time now to put it all into stone. So all those thoughts, start creating it into your reality. However, saying that, your message for this month is self-care is your priority. So as you go out there and you're looking at all these things that you want to create, remember looking after you is most important. So again we say self-care is your priority this month. Okay, Cancer, Cancer, Cancers, this is not a month for you to be overindulging, okay? Mo food, money, etc., you know, all those abundances in life, we can't overindulgence at this point. So this is the time where you take stock of where, where you want to be in the future and say, okay, Instead of having three slices of cheesecake, I'll only have a half, please. Okay? So good times are here for you, but you cannot overdo it at all. New relationships and friendships are also on the cards this month for you. So in that light, your message for this month from her says, think with your head and not with your heart. When we're going to overindulge ourselves, Remember to be in a um to be your true self and to stay clear minded, clear hearted with what you do this month. Okay? Because your message is think with your head and not with your heart. I love cheesecake too, by the way. Leo motivation and dedication are on the cards for you this this month. So this is the actually your best month of the year. So please use this astrology at this time and the eclipses as well as this retrograde that we're in because Leos, you're about to have the best month of the whole year. Whatever you put your heart into, it will come to be. 
So be very mindful of what you put your energy into this month, our Leo people. Okay, your message for this month from my lady is reward yourself for the effort that you've put in. So as rewards come in, don't go out and blow it and spend it all. Okay, remember that rewards should be held in, you know, held for future, like that cookie jar, held for future um, times when it's not so good. Okay, so be aware that if any money does come into you this month, please put it away for that rainy day. Your message again, reward yourself for the effort that you've put in. Virgo children, okay, confusions and confrontations are running amok for you this month. Okay, whether it's at work, with neighbours, your loved ones, etc., confusions will arise. If there are projects that you're working on, then there will be delays. So expect extra money there for budgetary reasons, okay? Because con confrontations and confusions are abundant this month for you, okay? It's time for you to look within yourself and to reflect on who you truly are. So when you do have these issues, arguments or past unresolved um, experiences coming forward, this is where you can say, right, well, this is who I truly am. Moving forward, this is who I want them to know I am as well. Okay? Your message for the month, contemplation creates confidence. Okay. When we know who we are, that gives us that confidence to go out and be it. So that's your message for this month. Whenever you have these issues or confrontations being presented, be your true self. For that's how you will gain that, con that confidence. And as the message says, contemplation creates confidence. Okay? So now we go into Libra. Good things are coming for you this month as well. Okay, money owed to you will appear. Now, just remember, it doesn't mean it's going to physically hit your bank, but it may be where steps to that fulfillment will come closer. So if it's a lawsuit that you're involved with, you'll get notified, oh yes, well, we've now progressed to that next level where we're getting closer to that stage being finalized, okay? New friends and hobbies for you as well this month. It must be the month to go out and meet new people, I think. Okay, very favorable stars are in alignment for new ventures. Now, when we talk about new ventures, that could be work, that could be new hobbies, okay? So this is your month to start getting out there, being seen, doing all those networkings to make things come for you, okay? Your message for this month is spread those good vibrations with others. Don't hold it all within you. Go out there and shine to everybody. For as again, your message reads, spread those good vibrations with others. Okay? Scorpio. Oh, Scorpions. Your intuition is high this month. So here we are in a month where it's very favorable for you to go out and start doing all those de personal development courses. If you've been thinking about doing some modality like Reiki or massage or even crystal understanding, good, this is the time to go out and start doing it. It doesn't mean you have to start the course, but just do your research so you know where you're leading to. This is a perfect time for success to come to you. So, Patience and practice is also required at this point, okay? If they, if you want to go into some sort of course and they say, well, it doesn't start for two months, that's giving you two months to research it more so you know what you're doing when it starts so it's very successful for you. Bonds will be formed and tribes will be found. So here we go. Bonds are those relationships that we create and tribes are the people who are on our same vibration. So they will be found for you this month with honest and passion. 
So be honest about who you are and what you want to be. Put your heart into it and you will find your success. Your message from her this month reads, this month is about you evolving. Use your intuition. Start practicing it. Use it on your friends and even your animals around you. Okay, see how you go and I wish you the best of luck there, Scorpions. Sagittarius. Oh, love and marriage is present for you and in focus this month. Psychological releases now can be made through that karma. So good lasting relationships can be acquired for you. Okay. Again, this is a month where we're all looking for the past to heal our past unresolved issues so we can move forward in more loving, trusting and dedicated relationships. Healing can occur, which will bring great happiness for you. Your message this month, Sagittarians, relationship interactions bring healing. So again, remember, be honest with how you feel and allow others to talk honestly and openly to you as well. Relationship interactions bring healing. Capricorns, oh, here we go. <clears throat> this is the month of endings. We've got frustrations. We've got delays. So this is where uncertainty and our fears can come out so don't allow it to occur to you for that brings us down negativity in in a negative vibration okay so the more that you use these times wisely to contemplate reflect and go over past unresolved issues so then when all these delays are set free and things start moving forward for you you're going to know exactly where you're going so when you do get frustrated this month all my Capricornians out there please be patient go for that walk and say what does the universe want me to learn while I'm waiting don't be frustrated with it okay uncertainty is only a concern if we allow it to become one okay your message for this month time to meditate and manifest your future okay i've got to repeat it time to meditate and manifest your future so be patient and allow things to unfold for all is coming when it should in the universal timelines okay aquarius miscommunications are on the board for you this month unfortunately progress is slow you're going to want to get out there and do a lot of things as usual but please again be patient for things come when things are destined to so it is a time to reevaluate and make those changes in your lifestyle as well when needed this is also a time for Aquarians to look at their materialistic lives. Is this time now to downsize? Do we need that $200,000 car? Can we downsize to a $50,000 car? If we're in a seven-bedroom house, can we downsize to a four-bedroom house? Those sort of things are required for your contemplation this month. Assess, reevaluate, and come up with a better plan for your future. So your message this month, my Aquarian friends, more effort will create harmony. That's straight from her. More effort can be just our thoughts, remember. But more effort creates harmony. Hope that helps you there. And my lovely Piscean friends, thank you so much for waiting. Last is always the best, right? Anyway, I'm a Pisces. This is our love month. Oh, yeah, get those happy vibes happening. This is the month to go out there and get passion within ourselves and to go out and be passionate to others. This is the most loved up 
month of the whole year for us. So spend this time extremely happy, harmonious and bringing out the love and passion in yourself as well as others. Okay, this is the time to go out and start new friends, new hobbies, new jobs are also on the cards here predicted. So it is time to finalize pro projects and move forward. Okay, the message for Pisces this month, passion brings out your best. That's straight from her. Passion brings out your best. So imagine and create all that you are. Hope that you've liked this month's horoscope. Please share this to your friends. Please like it if it has resonated you with you today. And thank you so much for being here. If you've learned something, my PayPal link is below. Thank you all for stopping by. Talk to you next month. Bye.